Hey gang, it's Kyle, and I just wanted to go over why we at Olaf hold basic movement quality as third most important uh, when it comes to health and fitness. So a lot of people hear it, and a lot of people already know that it's going to help prevent injury. A lot of people shrug it off like, yeah, I don't have time for that, I just won't fall or I won't play football or do things like that. So where it's going to bite them is going to be when you're like 85, if you plan on living that long, which I hope you do. Uh, 85 or 90 years old, and your arm only goes this high because that's as high as you've reached is top shelf in a cupboard somewhere for the last 40 years. So your arm only goes this high. Well, you slip on ice, arm goes back, it reaches back, and boom, there goes your shoulder. Well, <clears throat> at that point, 85, even if you were lifting weights, getting stronger probably isn't happening as much as you would like it to. It's more hanging on to the strength at that point. Um, well, you blew out your shoulder. That kind of so surgery takes a long time to heal anyways, and now you're 85, it's gonna take way longer to recover from that. Now, <clears throat> on top of it, it's hard for you to get your muscle back. So, <clears throat> it's gonna be really hard to strengthen it again. You just want to, <clears throat> hopefully, be able to use it let alone get your strength back to where it was. So while all this is happening, you have someone helping you because it was your right arm and you can't do anything anymore. So now you're getting assistance with doing everything. So now you're doing even less stuff and we're just doing less and less of using our body. Uh, it's breaking down. It's not being used as much. Strength's leaving. Eventually, we're just to be that much closer to the long end. So, um, that's why we encourage people to work on their ranges of motion <clears throat> in simple basic movements. Can I put my arm over my head correctly? Can I squat all the way down? Can I hinge? Things like that. Things you use in everyday life. So that's why we uh, uh, really drive home because when you get there, if you've already put in the work, that's just one less thing you gotta worry about when you're 85. So <clears throat> if you guys have any questions, please feel free to shoot me an email. My email is kyle at crossfitoloff.com. Thanks for listening, guys.